Hi, my name is Shaylee Gentry and I am the Craft Witch. I am an art teacher at the Emporia Arts Center and today I'm going to be teaching you a spooky craft based out of the book, Pizza the Cat, which you can or have heard my friend Ryan the Chef read to you already. Um, with your kit, you do get a link to him reading. You get a link to this video, which you've already found. Also in the kit, You'll have the book, like I've mentioned before, Pete the Cat, Five Little Pumpkins, and that is what this craft is based off of. You'll get a little pumpkin, a piece of black origami paper, and some black paint. What you'll need to do at home is create a craft environment where you can get a little messy because we will be painting. Um, you'll need to grab yourself a paintbrush and we're ready to go. So, to start, you'll need your Pete the Cat book. We are going to be crafting one of the pumpkins out of this book. I want to base my pumpkin kind of off this pirate right here. So I'm going to be painting the face a little bit like him, but you do have five pumpkins you can base your pumpkin off of, and you can also make your pumpkin a cat if you want to show off a little Pete love. So let's get going. All right, so now I have my paintbrush, my paint on the palette, my pumpkin, and my reference pumpkin. So I'm gonna do the pirate like I said before. You just wanna dip your brush in the paint. Now my pumpkin has triangle eyes with the triangles pointing up, the pointed part up. I'm gonna paint it like that. I think I really like having the middle without the black. So I think I'm gonna leave it open. There are my two eyeballs, and then the nose. It's also pointed up, just one small triangle. And then the smile has one, two, three, four, five square teeth. So to start this one out, I'm gonna start with a big smile. When I get lined up with that eye, I'm gonna bring it down into a square. And then bring it down into another square. Back up. Down. Square. 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 All right, now we're gonna fill in our smile. He's a very happy pirate. There we go. Let's see, what else would I like to add? I think I want my pirate to maybe have a little mustache. So you can kind of add something to make the design your own. Definitely doesn't just have to be on the front. Maybe we wanna add a little design on the sides. So I'm gonna do a big zigzag line across the outside. Maybe make it look like my pumpkin has some hair. Maybe some bangs would be good too for my pumpkin. And I'm just gonna do some light brush strokes to make it look like a nice hair texture. All right, 
And I'm not going to do the top because while your little pumpkin dries, we're going to be making an origami hat for them. So put your pumpkin aside for now. Let that dry. We're going to need our black piece of paper. This is a very simple hat, so it shouldn't take too much work or too much time. So you're gonna flip it over to your white side and you're going to match your white corners to your white corners, folding it in half. So, and then you're going to take, so your outside, your open flaps are on this side and your folded edges on this side. You're gonna take the open side, match to the open side. Fold again. Okay, now you open it up and you want the open part of your paper to be on the bottom. And you're going to fold down the folded side down to the middle up against this straight line you're making a triangle so that. do it again to the other side okay so now we have a big triangle and to do the rest of the hat, you're going to tear off the corners, just little parts of the corners of the open edge side. So now we have a triangle with two ripped off edges. You'll take, you'll find the inside with the white, fold up. will be the brim of your hat, flip it over and fold the same amount. And then you open it up. Now you have a hat. So when your pumpkin is dry, just set it right on top. a happy little pumpkin friend that you can decorate with every year. All right, that's all I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this short craft. Uh, we all want to say thank you here from EAC and happy Halloween.